old used to be the train tunnel now it's for the bike path coming through here and you see on the uh, top of the tunnel here it says 1904 and like anything else that old it is said to have been haunted so okay, here's a close-up like I say no ghost now unless you see it on the playback let me know uh, says caution ice may be forming in tunnel now if I do we're in October now, so if I do see ice, I am going to take that as a sign of being haunted. <laughs> Alright, I yeah, don't want me to do that. It's a nice bike path though. Alright, now we're going up this trail next to it. And that's going to take us to uh, the Indian Cave and Wetzel's Cave. So let's do that. Okay, see some signs of life here with the soda can. Now, and that's not the entrance. That's just the main entrance. It's the main entrance. It's bigger than I remembered. Oh, wow. Well. Can you get through? Well, I'm going to crawl. Uh, without crawl. Okay, don't take the flashlight if you can see on the night vision. I'm not going to trust the night vision. If you can, yeah, I was gonna say, no, I don't go on there. I don't know if it's too narrow. I think you have to turn something. There is some trash in there. Yeah, there's maybe just one right there. Can you see in there? Yeah. Yeah, so. Oh, there's a, there's a refrigerator, <laughs> a microwave, Let's see. and then up here, it's like, yeah. okay, you know what, I'm going to go in here, and in here, let's, let's come out the other side and see what it is. He's really opened up. Oh, he's doing some kind of tour. <laughs> All right, this is that exiting our great, great. How many greats was he? I think it's five greats. Five great Lewis Wetzel's great cave. Uncle, great uncle. Uh, great uncle named after. Well, if you've heard Lewis Wetzel Lewis County, this is. Named after Wetzel Lewis County guy. Anyway, uh, on what our grandmother parks this side? No, on on right, our grandmother parks, which is a a Briggs. Oh, okay. Okay, so updating the family line. Uh, Lewis Wetzel was a great, great, great five great uncle, and his brother Jacob was our fourth great grandfather. Okay, and he was the younger brother. Jake so, was the younger brother. Uh, being the younger brother, this was Louis Wetzel's cave, and this was probably Jacob's room when he came <laughs> over to visit. Yeah. They the just gave <laughs> him a guest room, which he either caved in or that's about all the further it goes. Yeah, that goes up to the cemetery or something, but I'm yeah. not going to do more. I like this kind of ledge on it there. That's So we're going to go on up this trail. This takes us to the Indian cave. I mean,
this is a nice rock formation all through here. See, I'm sure this is a nice hangout on the weekends or school nights for some of the local youths. is correcting a series of mistakes. I don't know if Lewis Wetzel wrote that himself. I know that other stone, he carved stuff into it. He might not have had use yeah. for the uh, He didn't have the his paint. paint with him there. <laughs> but I like that uh, skylight in the, in the cave there. Uh, see, this is looking back onto uh, the bike path. Down to Wheeling Creek. And where is McCullough's Leap over here? 